Jeremy, the, the first quarter, you guys got off such a bad start in turnovers. What was the, uh, the issue in the beginning of the game? Uh, uh, it was just a lackluster effort on my part coming out and um, careless with the ball. And so um, nine turnovers is not is obviously never going to get it done um, from your primary ball handler. So, uh, you know, that's just uh, something that I need to, you know, it's on me in terms of taking care of the ball and uh, and also the game in general. Um, I think if everyone wants to credit me for this last seven games, then I definitely deserve this one um, on my shoulders. And so uh, that's fine with me. Jeremy, it's been such a great ride for you so far. What was it like just kind of for you, you know, the emotional come down after such a, a high for the last week and a half? Uh, obviously, it's uh, it's very disappointing just because um, we felt like, I felt like this could have been a good game for us to win. Um, but all the respect uh, f- to New Orleans for what they did, and they came in here with a great, great game plan, and they – and they shot well, and they played harder than we did, and uh, they got the win. Is it is it kind of good to get this out of the way and go on with your season? I mean, you knew you were going to lose at some point. Uh, I don't think this is good because I hate losing. Um, but I know what you're saying in terms of uh, everything dying down a little bit. I think from that end, um, you know, it may, may help me, may help the team a little bit in terms of just um, having everything off the court cool down for a little bit. Jeremy, do you have a handle on what you can do to lessen your turnovers? And if so, what is that? Yeah, uh, I need to just come out with more energy. I think when I, I think in the fourth quarter, when I attack and um, I'm, str- I'm stronger with the ball and more, um, usually I, I don't have as many turnovers in the, in the fourth quarter than I do in, in, in early in the game. And so um, being patient also. Um, and, and reading the defense, and uh, I think, you know, that's something that I've struggled with, and uh, I really need to take a look at that now. Uh, let's talk something interesting. So uh, about the uh, All Star weekend. Um, so how are you gonna make the Ali pass to Blake Griffin in the game? Uh, am, am I on his team? I'm on. I'm, I'm on his team. Uh, it's going to be pretty easy. I'm just going to throw it anywhere in the sky, and he'll probably go and get it and uh, make make me look pretty good. So, uh, Jeremy, you have uh, several teammates coming in the next few days, impact players who are going to be joining this team. And I just wondered whether that's something you're looking forward to and, and how you think you'll be able to adjust. Uh, I, th- I, think, uh, I don't think it would change... Um, from my standpoint, my, my approach to the game, I think I'm going to come in with the same mentality to attack and be aggressive. And um, and then, uh, you know, I think I'll be able to run less pick and rolls and um, hopefully be more efficient. Um, and and uh, obviously, you know, it's, it's always a good thing when you have more weapons, more playmakers and um, not that we don't have enough right now, but obviously, someone with you know M- Melo's capabilities, you don't you don't uh, you don't get that every day from from anybody.